today's video, as you'll see by the title and the thumbnail, we are testing unbranded versus branded food and we're going to do a blind taste test. So we basically have to figure out which one is the branded one, which one is the unbranded one, and we're probably going to be surprised with our answers. So let's see what happens. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to go down below and hit the subscribe button and give it a big thumbs up and let's get into the video. So Josh is just in the kitchen preparing everything. What we're going to do is he's going to hand me something from behind the camera um, and then we're going to taste it and then we've got to guess straight away which one we think is branded and unbranded and then it will be revealed whether they were right or wrong. So we'll do it based on each product. We're going to have this blindfold on. Now this is my special one for my eyes so it looks a little bit stupid but it's the only, it's the only blindfold I've got so we're just going to have to go with it. I'm so excited. This is sample number one. Of the chips. Of the chips. Sample number two. Wait, let me clear my palette, as Josh said. The cleanse. Cleanse, that's why I cleanse my palette. They definitely taste different. And then, so then I think the first one I had was branded, and that was the McCain chips, and this is the Tesco's own that I've just had now. Shall I tell you the answer? Yeah. That's correct. Yes! That was such a distinct difference in flavour. Really? Yeah. Wow. Wow. That was massively different. Okay. Sample number one. Yeah. What is it? Oh, it's chips. It's on the table in a bowl in front of you. Just... There's two in there, so, but they're the same one. This is number two. There's also two in there. Yeah. My guess is number one was unbranded and number two was branded. That's correct. Big difference. Big difference, isn't it? In a cupcake case here is your first ketchup. Don't squeeze it or anything, just gently. And then on your left hand is two chips. Just use one of them. So this is my first sample. Correct. No. I know you did that on purpose. I promise I didn't. Well, that I was promise. super dumb. I promise. I can't see Josh. What do you mean? I think I know which one that is already. And then this is sample number two. Just if you're that confident, you should put it out there and what you think that was. What, before I've even eaten this? Yeah. I think that one that I just had was the unbranded one. Okay. And then let's see if this confirms it for you. Which one do you prefer? The unbranded one. Wow. If it was the unbranded one. You think you prefer sample one? Sample one, yeah. Was I right? Correct. I was right? Yeah. You're the right. first was unbranded, the second was Heinz. Yes. Yeah. Oh, I'm smashing it! Smashing it, babe! Yeah, you're doing good, actually. You're doing really well. I always find that though, the non-branded ketchups are always so much more tomato-y than Heinz. They're sugary, huh? Heinz is very sugary, whereas unbranded ketchup is very tomato-y. Yeah. Okay. Right, I've seen sample number one. In a little here. Give me your hand. Here. That's number one. Yeah. This is sample number two. Try to bear in mind your advice here. Yeah. I'm going with number one is Heinz and number two is Tesco. Is that your final answer? Yeah. That is correct. But only because your advice that got me there. Yeah. Sample one. It's a bowl with a teaspoon with nasty cornflakes. Have I got some on my spoon? Yeah. This is the equivalent of someone doing wine tasting and down in the bottle. <laughs> Have I got some on there? Yeah, you got a ton. Yeah, I was right. They're just unbranded. This is branded. Final guess. Wait. Right. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Wrong. Really? Yeah. This is branded? Yeah. Wow! 
That's really interesting. Flip's sake, I was hoping I'd get a full house. You can't do that, babe. You could have made me completely change my guess by saying that. Because the last two times I got it right, this time I got it wrong, and this was the only time you went, is that your final answer? No, but that's cheating. Alright. Sample number one. Definitely not getting this. Ready for number two? It's a bit personal, but... <laughs> and this is sample number two. How did you get air in there after preparing it for 10 seconds? <laughs> that is cheating, that's thrown me off so bad. Well, your other bowl is right there, so you can just try it again. Branded. And number two was? Unbranded. Wrong. Wrong. It was the other way around. Sample one. Hey, what is it? Popcorn in a cupcake case. I think I straight away. What's that? I think this is the branded. Sample two. Mmm! They're actually really similar. Mmm, no. Oh man, I'm confused now. This one's taking me longer. This is, this is hard. Okay, I think I know. First one's branded, second one's unbranded. Is that your final answer? You can't cheat. That's correct. Yes. Fair enough. I'm trying not to say too much because I don't want it to make you get it right based on what I say about them. Well, that's so competitive. I know. Sample number one. It's in front of you in a paper case. Oh, popcorn. popcorn. Any ideas? I think sample number one is unbranded, sample number two is branded. That is correct. I got lucky. Why do you think that is? It tastes a little burnt there. Slight tinge of burnt. No, that's so annoying. So you didn't do that by taste at all? You did that by the fact that one of them was obviously cooked in microwave, one of them wasn't. Uh, correct. You're so annoying. Ding dong. Yeah. Uh, yes. This is smoothie. It's oh, a, I'm a, looking forward to this In a shot glass, okay? Mm-hmm. So, sample one. I really want have wanted to drink this since this came on Friday. Yeah? What, well, is it unobtainably expensive for you to have it in normal life? No, but I don't really ever get smoothies. Save a little bit. Okay. Sample two. Okay, I'm purely going off of taste now. Instead of what? Sight? Well, yeah, <laughs> that's true. This one is a lot more watery. This one is a lot smoother. So I think the first sample that you gave me was branded. And the second was unbranded. Correct. Yes. I'm going to use that in, in my turn. Smoother. No. Water. Darn it. This is smoothie. Sample number one. In a shot glass. In a shot glass, yeah. This is sample number two. Oh my gosh, I can't tell. Oh, I think that's wow. Well. <laughs> it's a weird noise, that. Any ideas? No. And you're saying that? Branded. And sample two? Unbranded. Yeah, that's correct. How did you. Sample one. For the first taste, I think that's unbranded. Okay. But I might change my mind. Sample two. I'm 
pretty sure one is unbranded and two is branded. Correct. Yes! Is there a big difference? No, I'm not saying anything, mate. It's such a, I've never Sample eaten number one. This combo of food in my life. It tastes like branded. Is that your final answer? Wait, can you pass me another unbranded one? No. Why not? I'll pass you sample one again. <laughs> sample one. A, a, you passed me a sample one, a sample two, a sample one, and now another sample one. Yeah. Why would you do that? Because you got stupid with your words, and I'm not going to let you cheat. Are you cutting that out? No. I actually don't know now. Would you like one more of each sample? Yes, please. I'm branded. And sample two is? Branded. Incorrect. Oh, damn it. Sample one was branded, sample two is unbranded. Fair play. But they are. Sample one. Big glass in front of you. Okay, this is one and this is two, isn't it? Yeah. This is unbranded. This is branded. Correct. Yes. Big difference? <laughs> Not saying anything, mate. It still doesn't give anything away. Sample number one. Of what? Coke. Wait, this is Coke? This is Diet Coke. That's the answer then. No, this diet is cola. Oh, this is the cola. Diet. We know you're so annoying. That is sample number one of our unbranded or branded coke. <laughs> sample one, unbranded. Sample two, branded. Is that your final answer? Yeah. That is all correct. Yeah. <laughs> It's very obvious. Yeah. It's very obvious, isn't it? Yeah. So you got five out of seven and I got six out of seven. Well played. Well played, babe. Alright, could I go now? No, we just need to close the video. Thanks so much for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to go down below and hit the subscribe button and give it a big thumbs up if you did to get him back on my channel because he absolutely loves it. That was my last appearance of all time. It was not. He will come back. But thanks so much for watching this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you soon. Bye.